This is Science for Success, the best soybean management practices by extension researchers from across the United States. I'm Mark Lick. I'm an extension cropping system specialist with the Department of Agronomy at Iowa State University. Today I want to talk a little bit about the seed set stage of soybean development. And during this time frame, really what we're talking about is protecting and maintaining the leaf area um, because that's really the utmost of importance at this time frame. Uh, the leaf area is the engine capacity that drives seed size. So minimizing loss of leaf area by insects or disease is really quite important. This can be achieved by the use of fungicides or insecticides if the timing allows for the pre-harvest intervals to be maintained. Um, additionally, leaf area maintenance can be regulated by the availability of water and nutrients as well. Um, so really the management aspect of that really has to occur earlier in the year, or if you have irrigation systems, you'll be able to irrigate to maintain the water supply that's needed. So the greatest sensitivity to stress at this time of the year is right around that R5 to R5.5 stage, which is beginning to mid um, seed set. Um, once you get past that mid seed set time frame, then you start getting remobilization of nutrients and uh, photoassimilates through um, the plant, um, and that's what's filling out the seed. So a couple misconceptions that we um, commonly hear about this time of year is that we can apply some sort of a product to reduce drought stress during seed set. And, and this is uh, a huge misconception because once we have drought stress, or um, it could also be um, something very similar with um, excessive water, um, this will cause seed abortion and reduce grain fill. And we cannot overcome that by applying products, whether it be a fungicide or whether it be some other type of non-traditional product. Um, another uh, misconception that we typically hear is that we can apply sugars um, because the plant's producing sugar, right? So um, that will um, help us improve seed set and seed size. Again, that, that's a huge misconception. Yes, it is true that the soybean plant produces more than 6,400 pounds of sugar, um, and that's what's gonna set and fill about an 80 bushel per acre uh, soybean crop. However, applying small amounts that we typically hear of like five or 10 pounds of sugar per acre is just a drop in the bucket. So likely not gonna do anything for us. Science for Success is funded by the Soybean Checkoff.